Greetings, suns and moons, and of course, I have to welcome back all of my stars. If you're new to the channel, welcome to the mothership. I do appreciate all of you for your likes, your donations, your shares, your super thanks, the confirmations you send me through email, the comments, all right? I appreciate you, all right? You should be rewarded for the positive energy you show yourself, the positive energy you show me, the positive energy that you show up in this planet. Now we're going to get in there like swimwear. Now, Collective, I want to say to you, if you are truly healed, these readings won't trigger you, okay? If you are truly healed, you are not waiting for anyone. You are taking ownership of your life and you are a leader. And yes, a lot of you are in this leadership role. Okay, if you're not, then give it time. All right, nobody can rush you into doing um, into healing. Okay, so we definitely have you. You're single, abundant, right? In the past, you were put on some sort of time now. You may have felt alienated, okay, from friends or family, but you have a higher purpose, a higher calling on your life, all right? So here we have face your shadows and reach for the stars, and that's exactly what you are doing, all right? We have patience here as you learn and grow from your mistakes. Even if that mistake was spending too much time, energy, and money on people and places and things that no longer serve you. Some of you are multitasking at this time, all right? So you're really focused on your passion, okay? You could be an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius, or you're just someone that is an excellent manifester. Some of you, you may have to do some sacral chakra healing, all right? You may have done this already, and so you have some sort of creative spark here. Somebody may have been a little bit obsessive with your energy. Somebody may feel a little bit insecure. Maybe this was you in the past. Ooh, too many cards. Yeah, you have to learn how to say no, set some sort of boundaries. Right now, you're connecting with your spirit guides, or you need to. Rest and reconsider why is this here. <clears throat> Forgiveness. So you have to learn how to forgive yourself. Okay. A lot of you, this is forgiveness for your friends, your family. Okay. So how you feel is deeply connected to what you manifest on the 3D plane. Okay. So somebody is definitely in poverty. All right. You may have came from humble beginnings. All right. So sometimes uh, some of you, you may be entering a new <clears throat> tax bracket. Okay. Following your dreams or your, your, your dreams are manifesting before your eyes. But what I'm what I'm hearing is you have this dream life, okay? Some of you had to reevaluate what is important to you. If someone has been in your energy tampering with your energy, possibly be ooh, possibly because you don't want anything to do with them, okay? They're definitely receiving some sort of uh they're receiving some sort of karma. Through your fa your their finances, okay, or your finances, okay. So some of you, this person was stealing your intellectual property, all right. With talent being here, you had some sort of hidden talent. Some of you, you may have had some sort of loss of a job, possibly due to some sort of addiction here. You could be addiction counselor, is what I'm getting, all right. But you are somebody that's talented, all right. You may find out that your hobby is going to get you far. Why is patience here, please? Yeah, dreams are coming true. I just noticed that with nine being here, you are somebody that's a self-starter. A lot of you, <clears throat> you may have to travel for work, okay? Somebody could want to travel towards you. Too many cards. Keep your commitments. Laugh at your demons. Yes, so you're facing your shadow self at this time, definitely, with strength being here. Somebody thought you was weak. All right, somebody thought that you was going to flop or fail without them. All right, this could also be someone that may have felt like they had a choice between you and some sort of family structure here. This person sees you as beautiful. Somebody could also be doing some sort of mirror magic on you, okay? This person is like, they're envious. This is a love-hate uh, situation because this person is working so diligently to come against you. Okay. I'm hearing they didn't know that you were earth angel. Some people don't believe in that. Okay. So some people haven't healed enough to realize who is actually healed. Okay. So this person wanted to make you appear 
like something you weren't. They could have also been doing something, you know, some sort of beauty spell, okay? This person may be having massive uh, breakouts on their face. I'm also seeing a face peeling. I don't know if you're an esthetician or something like that. Somebody could have had a face peel, but this could also be like somebody's mask coming off here. So this person was doing some sort of projection magic here, all right? Trying to stop you, trying to block you trying to collect connect to your intellect i said collect okay so this may be someone that's trying to mirror you okay they're trying to use whatever financial endeavor that you had have okay for their yeah their for their personal gain here there's some sort of portal here somebody could have opened up a portal i'm hearing something about midnight why is this portal card here please Okay, so some of you definitely had some sort of curse on your finances here. This could have something to do with your sister, okay, or sister-in-law. This person could be an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius. So this was just somebody that was very passionate about messing with your finances here. This person is, you know, they may experience a bout of poverty here. This would be someone that was uh, financially successful all their life. They may have been a leader, okay? It could be a Taurus, Virgo, a Capricorn also. You could be this sister, okay? Or this is somebody's sister.